going to look at some basic height measurements with the high cow. First, we can drive the probe into a plate and establish a zero, creating an origin or a reference position. From there, we can take the probe and we can drive it up and we can land on a surface to take a basic height measurement, 471 thousandths. I can continue to drive up, take a second measurement, 1.88 inches. That is from the, that surface to my plate. The gauge also has a difference function, a incremental function, if you will, which will allow us to calculate the difference between the last two measurements we've taken. That I've programmed for our function key. So if I were to drive up and take another measurement, engage my probe, 2.36 is the distance from my current surface to my plate, my reference position. If I ask for the function, the difference, 472 thousandths is the difference from my previous surface to my current surface. Again, if I drive up, 2.95 is the distance from the surface that my probe is in contact with to my surface plate, my reference position. If I hit that difference button, that function button, it will give me the difference. 590 thousandths is my slot width. Just to show you one more time, if I drive up and I land on the surface, I'm always getting a distance from my surface to my, my reference position, 3.425 inches. My function button will give me the difference between the two last contacts from my previous to my current contact. It's 472 thousandths. And those are some basic height measurements with the high cal 450.